Thousands of Indonesian youth have registered to work as migrant workers in South Korea to fill up positions in the manufacturing and fisheries sectors. This migrant workers program is a government-to-government -government capacity between the Indonesian and South Korean government. Through a government-to-government -government program, thousands of Indonesian migrant workers are now set to head off to work in South Korea. In November 2021, the Indonesian Ministry of Manpower confirmed that the South Korean government has reopened South Korea to migrant workers and will remove the limitations regarding the number of migrant workers it will accept. And now thousands of Indonesians are signing up to become migrant workers in South Korea. According to the Indonesian Migrant Workers Protection Agency, this year over 19,000 people have registered to work in South Korea. They have signed up to work in various sectors in the country, from the fisheries to the manufacturing sectors. Furthermore, South Korea has not placed a quota limit on the number of migrant workers they will accept. Furthermore, the Indonesian Migrant Workers Protection Agency said they will also facilitate funding for migrant workers who need money to help with their move. This funding will come in the form of loans, as migrant workers can borrow up to 100 million rupiah. These loans can then be paid back in installments while they are working abroad. In the future, the Indonesian Migrant Workers Protection Agency is also planning to conduct government-to-government -government cooperations with Japan and Germany to send Indonesian migrant workers to work in those countries as well.